Hello guys, if you're looking to convert your iPhone, which runs on iOS, into an Android phone, as in run the Android software on the iPhone, well, you've come to the right place. This is actually a very easy method, so without any more talking, let's get right into the process. Uh... So the first thing you want to do is always, always back everything on your iPhone to the computer. So in case if you mess anything up, you can easily restore that backup and retry the method. So I've got this iPhone 4 already hook up, hooked up to the computer and it's almost done backing up. And when it's done, all you have to do is safely use the eject feature in the iTunes program. Don't just unplug it because you're about to do something big to your phone and even if iTunes says it's done backing up, there may be some system files still backing up, which if they don't get backed up fully, there may be an error when you try to restore after messing something up. And that would basically render your iPhone useless. You don't want that, do you? Ah! So, uh, here I am using the eject feature in iTunes. And there we go. Now I can unplug my iPhone. <coughs> Once you unplug your iPhone from the computer, what you want to do is go into the settings of the iPhone and then you want to just completely turn off the Wi-Fi. This is because when your iPhone is connected to the internet, it's also connected to the Apple servers. And if the people at the Apple servers detect that there's something off with your iPhone, well, they're going to blacklist your iPhone. And once they blacklist your iPhone, well, you can't really do this method because your iPhone is basically fucked. Yeah, you don't want that, do you? Ah. All right, guys, uh, make sure you've got your rice and candles set up in this exact formation. Uh, it's very important. And then place your iPhone right in the middle. Uh, see? Uh, on top of the goat blood from the goat you sacrificed earlier in this process. Uh, and now what you want to do is repeat this phrase with me three times. Make... America great again. <laughs> Make America great again. Make America great again. And now what you want to do is you dip your hand in some nice cold piss, some goat piss, and uh, touch your iPhone. And uh, now you wait. Now this wait, it differs in time depending on which iPhone you have. If you have an iPhone 6 or 7, It'll take six or seven minutes, but I have the iPhone 4, so it'll only take me four minutes. So I'll, I'll time lapse the video for you guys, and uh, I'll get back to you after the four minutes are up. All right, the four minutes are up. And now, if you did everything right, you should come back to an Android phone. Now, let's see. It seems like it worked for me, but I got a Galaxy S3. What the fuck? Uh? It wasn't supposed to work like this. Hold on, guys. Uh, let me redo the process and uh, I'll get back to you uh, again. <laughs> Make America great again. Make America great again. Make America great again. <laughs> Uh, ah. I'll get back to you. God damn it! I don't want a goddamn dog. Ah. Sorry, guys. Shit. I'm gonna have to do it again. Make America great again. Make America great again. Make America great again. <laughs> Ah. All right. Let's see what we got here. Uh, uh, ah, a Galaxy S7 Edge. That's more like it. Uh, it's not like that ancient S3. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> uh, well, 
I hope you guys like the video. This is pretty much how you turn an iPhone into an Android phone like this. Leave a like, a comment if you have any more problems with this process, and I will try to help you and tell you where you went wrong. Bye.